Hey you all, so autumn is one of my favorite times of the year simply because it's very relaxing when you watch nature, the trees are turning different colors, the leaves are coming off of the trees. Um, I just love how it looks outside during this time. Um, you guys could see like just such the beauty um, of nature. So. I'm headed on back home um, from the store and I'm just going to get into how I want to bring, you know, the autumn ambiance to my space at home and how, you know, it creates a cozy and relaxing environment, um, even like outside. But I want to bring that look inside, the feel of autumn inside my home. So I'm going to show you all how I accomplished that. I hope you all are having a great day. Definitely, if you like these sort of home decor videos, definitely like, comment, and subscribe. Share the video and let's get started. Let me know also in the comment section below, is autumn one of your favorite times of the year? Everybody, it is KBC and we are back on my Saber de Chanel channel so you all I just wanted to stop in for a minute and talk to you all see how everybody was doing darling um how are y'all today um because I know everything that's going on as far as like with you know the weather the hurricanes and different stuff that's going on like that so I just wanted to say you know hey hope everybody is doing well I hope everybody is in good you know feeling well, good wellness and everything. So I'm just sitting here, y'all, with a moment relaxing, y'all, like enjoying this moment that I'm in, right? And so I thought to myself, why don't I talk to them about how I style things? Like, you know, as far as I don't really do like, you know, um, different, a lot of different seasons and stuff like that. But I do occasionally like when it's different, like I would say autumn, um, switch up some stuff. You get what I'm saying? Like, I don't, I, I don't really do like, you know how people do like the, the typical, there's nothing wrong with it. It's just, I feel like when it's autumn, I do different things, um, as far as like seasonal things. So I'm going to be showing you guys how I style different things for autumn. Like, okay. For example, right. Right now, I'm enjoying, you know, my little lounge area, but I have like the chunky kind of chenille blankets and I feel like they're so warm and cozy. They're giving huga. It's giving autumn. Like, I feel like I want to sit here, enjoy like a nice cup of tea or coffee. I haven't made up my mind yet. But while we're on the subject, what is it that you guys like to drink during autumn or to enjoy a nice cozy lounge type of situation leave it in the comment section below but i also like in this area not only do i you know use different sh things like chenille throws but i also like to enjoy different scents so i have my candles going like here you know i have my apple candles it just gives me that warm cinnamon warm cardamom type of feeling so I'm just going to be taking y'all around and showing y'all the, you know, the little things that I do to kind of make it um, warm and cozy for autumn. Um, I'm not really, like I said, I, I don't really do like, you know, the huge seasonal elements like some people do. Um, and there's nothing wrong with it if that's what you do or whatever. I just, you know, lightly do things because it's like when it's time to move into other things or maybe if I want stuff to hang around a little while. I like stuff to be able to work for my everyday life. So I'm going to be showing you guys some things that I use to design and, you know, kind of add light touches, but still fit my lifestyle for autumn. So here it is. I hope you guys enjoy the video. 
like comment and subscribe share the video and all right you guys so nothing says autumn like a fireplace moment okay you guys have been with me along the ride <laughs> with the fireplace build so right now i'm just gonna show you like my fireplace is going you know i love the fact that it has a heated mode because autumn is a little cooler um and i know me personally i like to be warm and toasty um with some footies on right now i don't have my footies on but i typically would have my footies on honey sitting in the lounge area and enjoying the heat from the fireplace i also had the autumn vibe going with adding this warmth from this wood vase and the sprigs that are the nice crimson color because i love y'all that crimson color is very royal i love how it looks and how it pops off of that gold and it gives me that warm feeling that i'm looking for as far as you know making the space warm and it's you know what i'm working with right now and i'm just kind of enjoying these little pops of crimson all right y'all yeah. so keeping the autumn movement going here um i added this pop with these as well this really gave me kind of like um i like plants like i said um my style sometimes is a bit boho it's a bit rh inspired but these really stuck out to me when i went to the store to pick them up i like how they remind me of like feathers they're very kind of to me tribal and that's what i enjoyed about them um i also just like I wonder what kind of plant these are if you know what kind of plant this is because it seems like they dried out maybe like a real plant for this so if you know what type of plant this is put it in the comment section below but y'all i saw this at the store and i just loved it i knew that i wanted to kind of spruce it up in something now initially y'all i had it in something else i forget what i had it in i had it maybe like in a vessel or something but it just wasn't popping but i definitely feel like this gold kind of pot that I just had lying around um, definitely made this pop. I love it. I love how, you know, it looks in the mirror. I love how it bounces the creams and the golds and it bounces off of the black. It just really is a vibe, y'all. Like, it gives me that cinnamon kind of feel. I like it. And it also, like I said, the warmth here as well with the crimson. So adding that balance in this little space really was it for me all right you all so on to the autumn vibe when i'm thinking autumn i definitely feel this moment here you guys know on the last video we were on the hunt for a new bench we are still on the hunt for the bench you all but in the meantime this is what we are working with so when i think autumn i think of harvesty i think of beautiful golds and champagne colors and i also have my warm and fuzzy faux fur pillows and the throws to add that warmth as well as this tray because i feel like this tray was important because it allows me to put my decanter so i can have things like water if i need water at night and then just beautiful things to look at like another candle to set like ambiance um this is a beautiful beautiful wine glass i love the way the gold honeycomb it kind of has like the um hexagon accent at the bottom but it's like a honeycomb effect because y'all know i love bees okay um i love the gold sprigs it's kind of like i had in here before the crimson but i was like hey why don't i since it's already gold add these for like that harvesty autumn effect and it's just like a little light touch because even if it's not autumn, I can kind of transition this into every day. But it's just that light touch of coziness with the color that is really right, pulling you all. So we are on the gentleman's lounge side of my bedroom. And as you guys know, this is still a work in progress. Um, this is not the chair that's going to be in here. I'm going to find like a, a nicer chair um, for the gentleman's lounge side. But... For right now, it is giving us warm and cozy for autumn. And so let's talk about the elements that I have over here. So you guys remember I showed you all my tree. I love this tree. To me, I have like a tree similar in my garden. And it's this red color kind of like all year round. It's a nice crimson. And so I had it in a gold pot, but I wasn't really feeling it in the gold pot. So we went to at home. 
and I got this cute kind of RH inspired basket. It's really making it look more like polished. And then of course I'm gonna put some nice, you know, just to tie everything together on top. Y'all know what I'm talking about. And then right here, this is a nice little place to sit. Like if you wanna sit, read, but also if you need to charge any of your devices, I have my little cute candle um, lighter my nice crimson candle and it's giving the same kind of warm cinnamon apple smell as in the ladies side lounge of the bedroom so this is this cuteness this cute autumnness in this in this area i meant to say so yeah this is what we're doing over here all right you guys so this is what i've been working on this little vignette area right here is what i've been working on i have my ladder with the beautiful sunflowers okay that nothing says harvest more than sunflowers and the nice chenille like knit kind of um throws and i've added that beautiful gold kind of marigold pop of color as you guys see like i don't have the flooring in the hallway the reason why i don't have the flooring in the hallway you guys is because i told you i was not putting that flooring down until they do the major stuff um, up here. Because, you know, you don't want to put floors down and water-related stuff you have to come through here with and all of that. So, I have my beautiful mirror. I had this mirror in another space, but I have it here. And as you guys can see, um, the door, I'm kind of going through my home, painting all of the doors that nice um, kind of black color. And then I have this beautiful moment on kind of this reclaimed kind of wood piece that I have here. And then I found these really beautiful baskets. And those were from Marshalls for this space. They were like the perfect size. I have some other baskets here, but they were not giving the look that I have. So this is like. And then I have this nice, beautiful kind of floral piece. Um, I love the white and the green together and how it's looking in the vessel. But y'all, quick kind of pro tip. This was originally like this vessel. It was originally white. So what I did to give it like a similar look to my lamp on here, I like the shape of the vessel. So I went and got some Rust-Oleum flat black spray paint. And then I got the stone um, spray paint. I think it's by Krylon. And then I sprayed sprayed the stone one on top of the black. So it was white initially, like a kind of off-white color initially. And kind of like similar to that marble piece in the middle there. Like this. It was kind of similar to that. But I wanted it to be similar to the lamp. So you start off with your black rust-oleum spray paint and spray the flat black paint on and then you spray your stonework um spray paint on top and then you get this cute beautiful effect i'm gonna zoom in so y'all can see it it is beautiful in person um you guys remember i got my little candle holders um from another video i repurposed them here and then i have like a beautiful kind of um you know, it wouldn't be a cute little makeover without having a piece from Target Threshold, okay? Um, I have a cute little piece here, the marble tray. And then I have like the cute little candle on top with the um, candle wick, the gold candle wick. And then I have like the cute greenery plant and a black um, pot for it to sit on top of. So let me just stand back so y'all can see this really nice. So this is kind of, this is what it looks like. And it looks amazing, you guys.